When I wake up in the morning, I come outside. I love the weather. Even if it's cold, I love it. It blows in my face. I look around and I see the world of HaKadosh Baruch Hu. What a geschmack. I see the leaves growing when they're falling off. I see them turning colors. How beautiful it could be. Our eyes are made to see the beauty of Hashem's world. We can do so many mitzvahs with our eyes. So many things to notice different things. Notice chasad that needed. I'm telling you from a yeshiva perspective, a kid coming in with torn clothing. Our eyes show us the kid is wearing torn clothing. Let's go out there and buy him some clothing. Kid comes in and he's hungry. Maybe he's not eating at home. What's all the eyes? The eyes see and we do. The eyes see and we start working. That's what eyes are for. When you see a beautiful gemara and a beautiful pshat, wow, you see the beauty of Hashem again, the beauty of His Tyra. That's the idea of the eyes of HaKadosh Baruch Hu giving to us, to see the beauty of His world, see the beauty of our world. Unfortunately, sometimes the eyes pull us in a different direction, but that's not what the focus should be on. The eyes should pull us in the right direction. I believe in the Hagdama of the Levi Elio or Beli Latkan's three volume Givald Musa Sefer. Tells a story there. When he was Mashgiach in Kfar Hasidim, Abba came over to him and said, Rabbi, I have a bris tomorrow morning in Tel Aviv. May I go to the bris? He says, Tel Aviv? In Mitten Zummer? Sometimes it's like a public beach. We can stay again. How could you go there? So the Bach said to Rabbi Lapian, Rabbi, no issue. I have no problem. I'll go there. I'll be just fine. He says, What? He says, You don't understand. I'm 85 years old. I have only one eye that I can see with. Du hast zwei fleischige Eigen. That's the expression. Two fleischige eyes. And you're 17 years old and you go in Tel Aviv and it's not going to affect you? I, as an 85 year old man, with one eye working, it affects me. That's what a name can do. Says he, stay in the yeshiva. Stay where you're surrounded by Torah. What are you going to see? The Kedusha of Abbas Madrish, the Kedusha of Tefillah, the Kedusha of Bachrim who are looking at the right things, the Kedusha of Rebbeim looking at the right things. That's where it's at. That's where it's at. Don't put yourself in a sakana. We have such beautiful, beautiful eyes. That's what we have, HaKadosh Baruch Hu's eyes. It gives us our wonderful eyes to see good things with. When we see beauty, when we see HaKadosh Baruch Hu's world, wow, how wonderful it is.